more goodies. This should be Gundam kits. Hope. Three boxes. This one actually arrived uh, Friday. As far as I recall, it's not the most exciting box. I think it contains six or something like the RG Zeon. I'm not quite sure what I got a split delivery like that, but I did. So the first thing that comes to my sight here is the Galbaldi. Now, I think we already have this one. So this is uh, an old bag order that arrived. And then we have, these two kits are actually all new in the shop. It's not new kits, but new in my shop, the Geta Arc. I never dared to buy this one because I wasn't quite sure I could sell it. It's not like the Messinger and those are selling like in thousands. So, well, I tried to buy one just because I like to have everything that Bandai produces. There are always something I'm not buying, but that would be like different universes. Then we have, this one is also a reproduction. Finally, they decided to put the Marasai bag in. I never had it in those three and a half years I had this shop. So that probably means it's been out of production for something like that, because I don't think I ever saw it, actually. It looks pretty awesome. I think you could do some cool things with this kit, weathering or whatnot. It's a cool design. Let's see. Well, this format where I just use one hand is a bit more tricky. So, some prefer the one way, some prefer the other way of unboxing. Some don't care. Some just want me to do it the way it's easiest. I try to please everyone, so I just do a little of each. Let's see. Yeah, it's not the most exciting unboxing. More Marasai, and then we got the Master Grade Delta Plus. And as far as I recall, I'm not quite sure that I actually have any of those anymore. Let's just take a quick peek here. And if so, I forgot where I, where I put them. Hmm. Nope. I don't think I have it. So that's great to finally have that one back in stock. Yeah. So Marasai and Delta Plus. Let's see if I was right about this one. That it only contains RG Zeong. I'm actually getting, I think it's four more boxes of stuff. Yeah, it's the Xiong, eight pieces. It's just a master case. So, maybe it was eight then. Yeah, but that's just a short video. I mean, those three boxes, four kits, nothing exciting, but at least we got some new stuff. The Marasai and the Geta Arc. So if you need some of that stuff, feel free to uh, visit the website. And then I, I had a, an idea this weekend that I thought that I might do something crazy about the, uh, the office. Because right now the office is pretty dull, pretty boring. I mean have some stuff going on around here but I had some crazy plans because I'm actually an old gamer I'm, I'm not gaming anymore I really don't have the time for it but I saw some of these crazy gaming rooms and I just thought that if I wanted to enjoy sitting at my office the way I enjoy being in the warehouse then I had to do something so I think I'm gonna move the tables 
around so one table will be like this uh, flip it so uh, the face will be watching that way another one will be placed here so i face this way and maybe my building space over here so we will have a big desk all the way around maybe buy a huge curved monitor and a television up here and you know a lot of led lights maybe move the hexagon panels in here together with the light bar have some LED strips, paint the tables white, try to get white computer, white monitor, pictures on the wall, and you know, do it all nice. Two seconds. Sorry, sorry for the small interruptions. Not like it's easy when chauffeurs just come knocking on the door and walking in without an appointment. <laughs> they needed to uh, get some directions. Well, anyway, that was just a thought I had. Uh, the economy is not ready for that yet, but I just thought that that would also might help uh, do some videos inside the, the bat cave and make it more cozy, more nerdy, not like this. This is just a plain dull office and not, not really the way I wanted it. So if you uh, want to have an idea of what I'm thinking about, just go write cool gamer rooms, search on Google pictures and you will see all these, uh, very colorful setups with a lot of monitors and it, it just looks awesome so i thought about that might be an idea to uh, to make the office even cooler and then i could uh, move the uh, the last display box down here so we have three and move the entire setup inside the office so i will both have a building space computer space working space editing space whatever so everything can be done at the same place makes maybe more sense the idea with this part was of course that if i am gonna open it for a showroom people might need to see how it is working but then i can just remove um, secret stuff from the office so people can go take a look in the office on the opening days so i don't have my personal papers lying around with customers names on it and stuff like that that's not legal so uh, I just have to figure out how I'm gonna gonna do that and how much it's gonna cost and how much time it's gonna take because painting on these tables requires me to sand them down and it's gonna take a while and I might not paint and just keep it the way they are I just thought it would be it would be uh, an awesome thing to do. So that might be in step two anyway, to test out the format first. Well, that was just a small little plan I might have, some of my thoughts i like to share with you guys. So I'm gonna put these on the website if anybody needs a Geta Arc or a Marasai uh, or a Galbaldi or a Xeon. Um, and I will make a video later today regarding merchandise. I will have two boxes incoming. And then maybe later this week I will have more goods incoming. So, see you soon guys.